Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to share with you all one of the most popular drinks in the world and that's for bubble tea. And I'm going to show you all how to make it at home and I'm using store-bought tapioca pearls but if you want to see a video with me actually making the tapioca pearls, comment down below and let me know. So to make this, I got these tapioca pearls at Food Town here in Florida. They have different varieties, different flavors and different colors, but I went for the traditional black. So you can find this on Amazon or you can get it here at Food Town. So to make this, you're going to need 10 cups of water for every one cup of tapioca pearls. And we'll need to bring that water up to a bubble before we even add in the pearls. So while that comes up to a bubble in the next pot, with some water, we're going to steep some tea. Now I'm using tea leaves, you can use tea bags if you want, and you're just going to allow it to simmer, allow it to steep. Once it starts to get that really strong, rich tea flavor, you want to set it aside and allow it to steep. Now these are what the pearls look like. And I would say just buy it. It's a lot of work to make it, but of course I'll do a video for you guys because I love you guys. So. Once the water comes up to a bubble, go ahead and place the pearls gently into the boiling water. I'm following the instructions on the package. Each package has different directions. Now we just want to gently give this a mix so it doesn't stick to the bottom and we are going to allow these to boil until it starts to float to the top. It will take about a minute. Now you'll see that they're going here but they're not 100% floating. We need all of the balls to be floating to the top. So once the pearls start floating to the top, they're all floating, cover and rest for three minutes. Next, I'm going to strain my tea that I had steeping. Guys, use any type of tea that you like for this. I'm just using my favorite Arabian tea here. Now I'm going to make the milk mixture, so to my container I'm adding in sweetened condensed milk and full cream milk or also known as whole milk here in the US. And I'm going to give that a good mix and set both the tea and the milk in your refrigerator to chill. Now for the tapioca pearls, once they're finished sitting there for that 3 minutes, you want to take them out and place them in some cold water. It doesn't have to be ice cold, but it has to be cold or cool water. As I said, I'm following the instructions on the package. Once they're finished resting, you let them rest for like about three minutes. See how they look? And once they're finished resting, we'll go ahead and take them out of this water and place them in a bowl. To the pearls, I'm going to add some honey to sweeten and give that a mix. This just helps to sweeten the pearls, but if you wanted to skip this step, feel free to. And if you wanted to use another type of sweetener or sugar, also you can do that. So now it's time to assemble. We're going to start with our pearls at the bottom of our glass. Put as much or as little as you like and this one cup actually it can make three sets of drinks in goes our chilled tea next goes in some ice and now for the milk just look at those swirls guys really amazing delicious tea Remember, you can use any type of tea you want to make this. Just use your favorite, black, English, whatever you like, you use that. I really love this Arabian tea. So just give it a mix and once it's mixed in properly, it's now ready. So I hope you guys enjoy today's recipe. I will leave the link to purchase the pearls on Amazon in the description box. So make sure and click that little down arrow. I hope you all try it. Comment and let me know. If you want to see how to make the pearls from scratch, comment and let me know and I'll try to do a video for you all if it's a popular request. 
Thank you all so much for joining me today in the kitchen. Thank you all again for requesting this recipe. Please remember to stay safe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye.